Okay, so a little bit about UCI. We are uh, awarding all these, we are recognized on the HEC for several degrees, including LLB, HND, and these Monroe problems. And we are on the process of constructing a new, plot, a new building in uh, H9. Uh, so it's a very, uh, it has a lot of land, as you say, 15 canals, and uh, uh, this should be available uh, for us to move on uh, this year at the end or perhaps next, early next year. So uh, our mission has been ever since 1992 to uh, have these achievable and uh, recognized internationally degrees and at an affordable price, uh, much cheaper than actually going abroad. These are the qualifications that are offered at UCI, and these are the awarding bodies. So this is the, 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 the scheme of things. We, we offer the teaching, and, and we are, uh, allow and, and prepare the students for these exams. And then, um, and we've been pioneering, not only in the University of London, even ACCA. We are, we are doing ACCA since 2001, which is one of our very, very first colleges teaching for this qualification. These are our, some, of, some of our eminent high achievers and uh, you can say uh, prominent uh, ex-students uh, of UCI and some of them well known for the media and some of them well known in the respective professions. Hmm? All over the world, in, the, in Washington, in Pakistan and uh, in, uh, in France. Uh, now a little bit about Monroe College. Monroe College is located in New York, USA and uh, it has 1,000 international students and about 8,000 students. So, uh, and it also has sub campuses, uh, a campus in St. Lucia, the Caribbean. And it's a very competitive and very, uh, uh, very uh, down-to-earth, ach affordable, achievable school uh, college. So, uh, uh, in, our, in our situation, they will be uh, sponsoring our students when they want to go over there. These degrees from Monroe are accessible, they are affordable, and they are achievable. They can be, attainment means that they can be done with work, but most of it consistency. So uh, it, they are designed uh, to be passed with regular work. So the tuition is quite affordable, and uh, Monroe has even given, the, it's already a, 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 a not a very expensive college, and they have already given uh, uh, a further discount of $2,500 per semester for students when they go over there. And obviously studying in Pakistan is much cheaper. So in your handouts you have there some comparisons of these fees, okay? So, and we have further on, we have added a 30% discount for these initial uh, students that will join us uh, in this year and maybe in also next year. And what is the most important thing about this program? why we call it the first ever in Pakistan. And that is that it is an American program, but taught by UCI lecturers. The UCI lecturers will teach the students and they will be considered adjunct faculty of Monroe. The, this degree is approved by the HEC and the enrolled students will be treated as internal students so they can transfer to the, U, to the New York uh, after the uh, second semester. The, the, Second semester in the case of BB MBA and a post semester in the case of BBA. What is not is distance learning because the students will be evaluated here in Pakistan by our professors using the technology of Monroe. And uh, there's no external assessment, there's internal assessment and it is required uh, attendance. So this is a completely different scheme of work than our previous uh, international programs and uh, University of London and ACC and all that. So this is what uh, we know it's a very, very new and different way of uh, doing it. Our teachers, uh, they will, the classes will be held at the college. Uh, lecturers are going to be trained by Monroe. They are going to be uh, using their learning management system and uh, Blackboard attendance and all that. So the whole system of the class is going, to, it's uh, digital. But the lectures are being done by our teachers and the assessment of the assignments will be done by our lecturers and uh, they will be then, this assessment will be monitored or uh, double checked by Monroe. And uh, the students have, they all have to have their laptops, upload their assignments into this learning system 
and there is a need of attendance. So in that way, this is a very different program to the other uh, distance learning programs that are available uh, in Pakistan. Uh, there is a BBA program, the one that we are launching, and it has several ways of doing it. Four semesters in, pa in, in Pakistan in UCI, and then transfer to, to um, uh, Monroe in New York, or eight semesters in UCI, and then you finish your degree over here, you will still be given exactly the same Monroe degree as if you had gone over there. Okay, and the, in the last four semesters, there are several possibilities of specialisms in different areas of business. Uh, may I say that the entrance requirements are uh, achievable. They are um, um, an essay, the grade, and uh, year, 18 years of age, and there's an English test, and uh, we've, we've opted to train our students if they don't have uh, already an English test, it's for the Duolingo test, because it's quite affordable, it's about 60, 65 dollars, and can be repeated twice, you know, and it has a very good inbuilt training. Uh, uh, it's not really very difficult. A very different test than IELTS and TOEFL. Still, it measures in the same way the level of English. So, and, and an essay. So, very doable requirements. Uh, the MBA study program is a little bit similar. Four semesters, then it's two semesters in, in UCI and two semesters in, in, uh, in Monroe, or you can do the four semesters in UCI. Uh, and there are several specialisms in the last semester. These are some of them. Uh, not all of them will be available here in Pakistan. We will have only a few. Uh, some can be uh, done online and some you will have to, definitely all of them are available in New York. So what we really want is that we will cater for our local students, the ones that cannot go back with one or two of these specialisms, but we hope and expect that most of the students will be able to transfer to USA. Okay? So the entrance requirements for the MBA are also very similar to the entrance requirements of all other MBA, 16 years of education. Now the dual language is a little bit higher. It was 90, now it's 105 and then a longer essay, and of course your CV and recommendation letters. Mm -hmm. So all very, uh, you can say, uh, not complicated um, entrance requirements. Now the most important thing here is that people, uh, uh, inquiries keep asking, how am I, going to, am I going to get the visa or not? Okay, we cannot really say that, that you are going to get the visa, but there is a quite a likelihood of it for several reasons. Number one, we will prepare the students for the in interview. Number two, obviously, we are telling the students you need to have the money already in the bank before whatever you need for your second and third year, for one year at least. And then uh, you need to have a certain grade. Of course, your English test has already been done, so it's clear that you know English. And uh, uh, Monroe College will give you a, 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 the, the forms, the I-20 and all that. And you are really a transfer student. You are already a proven, as you like to say, a bona fide student of Monroe, because you've already done one year or two years in the case of PBA or one year in the case of MBA. So the visa is quite sure uh, on, under these circumstances. The other very important thing is that Monroe College is located in New York, the heart of business of USA. And USA, whether we like it or not, it's one of the most important economic powers of the world and where everybody, you know, a lot of people uh, would like to go and work over there and have that experience of being in the USA and work. So there are many, many internship opportunities uh, over there and the most important thing is that Monroe College has a very good uh, career service over there and sort of allows students to uh, and promotes and, and helps the students in getting these internships. Furthermore, the people that do a degree from the USA have this curricular particular training of CPT, which is 20 hours per week or 40 hours during the break. So you could have, literally you could be working while you're studying. Hmm? And of course in America there are many, many jobs that are part-time and you know, on hourly basis, so it's not so complicated to get those sort of jobs. And what is more important is after graduation you have this optional practical training or OPT which is after completing your BBA or MBA, you can work for 12 months, and if they are, uh, you know, even extendable for six more months. So 
this op uh, optional practical training is also a very useful way to gain uh, experience on the uh, on the ground for uh, for uh, uh, for your degree. And um, if you come back to Pakistan, you come with with some experience as well. Mm -hmm. Specialisms of the MBA are very interesting, and uh, I think uh, uh, they, they are uh, uh, very uh, you know healthcare, finance. Uh, information technology. They are very, very business analytics. They are very, very modern and upcoming. And if you are doing your MBA over there in the USA, your final year over there, and you have an internship, you know, in New York, which is the hub of all these areas, then you can uh, really like to land a very good opportunity later on. This is the opportunity for people to go to the USA and finish your degree over there and avail for your internships over there Avail for the working opportunities that you have over there. And, and the thing is this, that uh, you know, the way in which this course is going to be taught with our local lecturers engaged in the learning management system with, the, with Monroe, it's basically our students over here are really students of Monroe. And our lecturers are really lecturers of Monroe. And the opportunities that USA has for our Pakistanis are fantastic. We just need to find a way to reach there. And even if you go there, you do your MBA, and then you, you come back to Pakistan, there are many, many you know, foreign uh, uh, companies that would like to employ somebody who has a foreign degree. And the thing is that if you want to go and do your MBA in America, uh, you have to think about, I don't know, yearly 40, you know, I don't know, thousand dollars per year, minimum, for living and everything. So in this way, you're cutting your, your course, your uh, fee by half, and not only that, you are even having a, a 2,500, you know, discount from their side, from Monroe's side, and uh, and uh, you are still getting your American degree. Yeah, at that. So you know, when we put all our numbers together, and we compare, obviously, uh, Monroe College and maybe Lams is not the same thing. But the thing is, Lams is located in Pakistan, Lahore. Yeah, as far as I know, it's in Lahore, and Monroe College, it's in New York. So even if you're going to spend the same amount of money, but you go to New York and you get to do internships over there, it has a value for a lot of people. Even if it's the same amount of money. Hmm? So this is really uh, what we, Monroe's spirit in all this is that they would like to give an opportunity for people to go to USA and experience life over there. And if if it doesn't happen, we will finish it over here. They will still have their degree from Monroe in Pakistan. They will, the, the, the degree will not be different to the one that they are going to obtain over there. Yeah, Catherine Aziz, she is from the United States Educational Foundation. Hello, my name is Kathy Aziz. I manage the Education USA Advising Department at the United States Educational Foundation in Pakistan, or USCFP. At USCFP, our mission is to promote mutual understanding between the people of Pakistan and the people of the United States through educational and cultural exchange. University partnerships are one way to further this mission as they open the door for more Pakistanis to benefit from a U.S. college or university degree. With thousands of academic programs, world-class institutions, and unmatched flexibility, the United States offers a wealth of opportunities that you won't find anywhere else in the world. We'd like to take this opportunity to congratulate Universal College Islamabad and Monroe College on your new university partnership. We wish you the best in this new endeavor. And remember, Education USA is your official source on U.S. higher education. Reach out to us anytime if you'd like more information on the wealth of options available to you in the United States. Thank you. Good afternoon. My name is Alan Bicker. When I started UCI back in 1992, I could not have envisaged the tremendous progress the college has made. This has been entirely due to the unfaltering leadership of Dr Allende and her very able staff. The partnership with Monroe College marks a further and exciting development 
of UCI's curriculum and shows the high esteem in which UCI is held internationally. It provides great opportunities for all students, but especially for those wishing to develop their business acumen and career chances. I commend it to you unreservedly.